Really? Well, here's the thing. Do they want to bring in competition for Blake Bortles, or do they want to leave it his job, I meaning Blake Bortles' job? That's a big debate. And will Tom Coughlin sit there and say, now that he's got so much more control and personnel, will he want to push that? Does it make a lot of sense? Probably not, you know, honestly. But it is a possibility that Jim and I talked about. It's hard to find a landing spot for Jay, to be truthful. Yeah. From the standpoint, 11 years in the league, only one playoff appearance, one playoff victory in Chicago, 51 and 51. His last four years, 17 and 29. Is that something you really want to buy in and believe that this guy can suddenly lead your team to a championship? Because the problem with Jay Cutler, as Jim talked about, is if you trade for him, that's a $15 million hit on your cap. Yes. And do you want him, and especially trying to find that home for him? So it's interesting. The other one I feel like has a chance, depending on what all plays out with some other quarterbacks that we'll talk about, is Houston. And the reason why I think Houston could work is we've seen what Bill O'Brien can do with a lot of different quarterbacks. But what can he do with a better quarterback than what he has? Jay Cutler would obviously, to me, be an improvement over what we've seen before in terms of just the ability to be Brock Osweiler and beat him out. So is this a possibility? I'm kind of speculating here, but I could see it actually make some sense because.